I'm Andrew Hoyle for CNET, and I'm here at Mobile World Congress checking out the Geek's Phone Peak, the top model of Geek's Phone's two Firefox OS offerings. A Firefox OS is the new software from Mozilla. Visually, it looks a little like a cross between Android with the multiple home screens and iOS with the big grids of icons. You'll see four icons at the bottom of the screen that always stay there, giving quick access to the essentials of the Firefox web browser, your phone contacts, and your messaging. It's quite a clean interface and seems fairly straightforward to use, but we will have to spend a lot more time with it before we make a final verdict. It's based on HTML5 rather than Java, which is apparently easier on low-end hardware. Now, that's good news, as this only has a 1.2 GHz dual-core processor. That is bigger than the 1 GHz single-core you'll find in the Geek's Phone Keon, but in comparison to phones like the Galaxy S3 or Sony Xperia Z, that's not really that much power. Visually, it's not a bad-looking phone. It's got a clean white design, and it has a satisfying weight to it that's not unlike Nokia's Lumia phones. It has a 4.3-inch screen with a 960 by 540 pixel display, which seems reasonably bright and sharp enough for the essentials. On the back, you'll find an 8-megapixel camera with a 2-megapixel camera at the front for video calling. Geek's Phone haven't confirmed pricing for the Peak yet, but we are expecting it to be somewhere around the $200 mark when it goes on sale in a few weeks from its website. I'm Andrew Hoyle for CNET, and this is the Geek's Phone Peak.